everyone welcome back for more exo zero's content in today's video we're going to discuss all the details about chapter 15 and how to clear it but before that if you want updated exo zero's content please hit the subscribe button down below so hey guys here we are at uh, chapter 15 weight of blood so as you can see i have already cleared um every episode of chapter 15 um but i'll i'll go through what are the key um, factors that you should prepare for when you're finished with chapter 15 or when you're going to to play chapter 15 so um i'm going to 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 go through the couple of uh, enemies key enemies that you'll be facing um for chapter 15 so we'll start off with the banshee so banshee is is like the i think the minion of uh, i think it's uh Who's the guy? I forgot his name. For Baelish, sorry. For Baelish, so the minion of Baelish are the Banshees. So the skills of this creature is Touch of Death. So deals 20% of target's minimum health as damage upon dying. So um, additional damage uh, upon he dies. Reduces normal damage received by 65%. So very tough. Increases attack at the start of the round by 20%. Grants tenacity mark to self uh, if break status is triggered on self reduces the duration of break by two turns for each tenacity stack. Okay, so take note of that and deals 200% damage to one enemy. So not a biggie, just just uh, make sure that you have enough health so that um, uh, what do you call this? So that you'll withstand uh, his damage upon dying and also make sure that you you bring high damage heroes to your team as well so most of most of the the stages are your opponents will be banshee and also these guys so most of them are saint elite broadsmen so nothing special just um counters so be careful with counters as well when you have when you're playing this um, chapter so more or less the same for Nero when you encounter Nero in episode 7 so attacks an enemy if takes damage and its health drops to 10% or less okay so status effect immunity so immune to all status effects also reduces damage received by 65% so basically the theme for for chapter 15 um just i'm, I'm just gonna move ahead even even up to the last episode which is chapter that the, the, the last episode that you're going to fight with is chapter uh sorry episode 13 it's usually damage reduction so the key here is bring bring in um high damage units preferably with signature force um the stages are not easy to are easy to clear sorry but it's more of it will really take time and it will be a grind and some of the stages you won't even uh what they call this you won't even have a three star so some of the stages that i've have right now um i'm only up to two star but most are in three star so again toughness is actually their uh, main theme so damage reduction and 65 percent is actually a big amount okay so special increases on attack by 50 percent for 10 turns when own return reset decreases hit of all enemies by 70 percent every two rounds okay so take note of that so again um nero is not really um not really a threat um in terms of progression for chapter 15. you all you have to consider is um making sure that you have bigger damage uh with bringing in heroes so where are we we're at episode eight no none so same here so damage reduction as well that's basically the whole theme of this chapter again damage reduction nothing nothing really significant the most sig the, the significant um um enemies will happen from episode 11 to, to 13. So for 11, you have here Tantalo. So also has damage reduction and has provoke, heal over time, tenacity. 
heals 1.5% 1.5% of own health at the start of the turn. So it's also important that you bring um, Ramji here for for nullify heal. So he has provoke, paralyze as well. So so it's also important if you have um, what they call this machine guardian stones. You can actually have it uh, have your heroes equipped by machine guardian stones as well. So if I may suggest actually um, starting from from Tantalo moving up to or from episode 11 moving up to episode 13. So again for dark I'm suggesting number one is Ramji because number one he is he is a dark hero plus he has an AOE spell. You will need those in breaking guardian stones. So if you can see here the um, the guardian stones that appear in this chapter are light darkness and nature so make sure that you have heroes available for that it doesn't really have to depend it doesn't really have to be a nation based theme for for this as long as you have leveled them up and they can be actually they're, they're at a decent level like level 90 um at least at least um i think rank one rank one gear um not really leveled up um decent enough that they could survive and they could deal damage preferably high damage heroes again because although you'll be clearing most of you guys will be clearing chapter 15 up to episode 13 but again i i told you that um some of you or most of us actually will not be able to clear or not able to have three stars okay so we will have to make sure that we deal more damage because um, there are some hurdles in 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 playing the the, the, the episodes because your um, one one of them is actually your hits will be limited. So if you can see here, so you had a hit limit of forty five. Sometimes you will exceed that because you can't kill the enemies that fast. Okay, that that's most of the hurdles that I've had in playing this game. So. More or less, again, for Dark, you bring Ramji, probably Shufraken in the mix. For for Light Heroes, preferably you bring Garf. This Garf has an AoE at the back, or you bring Schmidt. Schmidt is actually good, um, so that um, his, his S1 is actually an AoE, uh, so that you could break Garden Stones. An option is also Iris. Iris is there to break single Garden Stones, but she is there to bring to give you mana for your team. So that you can bur you can use burst um, spells if you have them on your team as well, and for nature, nature you have Jinai, Tantalo. Th these are options that you could bring Rudley and Talia. It's also important that you bring um, what do you call this? You bring healers to the team like Rudley, Talia, um, what uh, whoever healers you have. At least bring one because you need to survive the enemy. The enemy is actually very tough. Um, uh, it's very tough damage reduction and uh, matches actually are longer with chapter 15 not really that that hard so I'll have demos later Tantalo is not really that tough you just have to make sure that you deal big damage and try to try to make sure that you aren't paralyzed but by his S2 by bringing in um, um, machine garden stones okay so we move on to episode 12 so for episode 12 you'll be your opponent will be benton benton is actually um annoying as well because he's immune to status effects reduces the damage as well and the counter is actually very annoying because if you have if you only if you have weak heroes he will really, you know, um, crush them. Um, again, bring tough heroes, bring heroes with high health so that you can actually withstand um, attacks or counter attacks from Ben 10. So he has a burst for all enemies as well. So be careful about this, but nothing big in particular that you should uh, be worried about. So for the final stage, actually for episode 14, it's it's just a simple stage that you have to go through. But the highlight of ep of uh, what you call this of chapter 15 will be Baelish and his Banshee. So for Baelish, so 
Let's go through his skills. So his passive is removes enemies' buffs and gains one mana. Take note of that. So removes one mana, the target, and has um, gains mana, blah, blah, blah. Status effect immunity, immune to all status effects, and also, again, reduces normal damage received by 65%. So um, this game will be very long, again, because not only is, his, is he reducing damage, he actually revives all dead allies. So take note that even his dead allies, the Banshee, have reduce um, normal damage so episode 13 will be a pain in the neck because they will be very hard to crack okay so and also he has nullify heal for his s1 so take note of that so you have to make sure that um, you can survive this uh, you have tough units as well, um, hard hitting, tough units, and also again for his S2, he afflicts stun, which again you have to have um, machine guardian stones for this one. So I'll have a a a run at a what do you call this? A run at um, trying to what do you call this? Trying to defeat the uh, Baelish for you guys. So that you can see more or less who I brought. So this is actually what I brought or who I brought. Uh, I have to bring uh, Iris here for burst of Redley, uh, Ramji, Garf, and Jinai at the back. So we'll start. We'll have a one round with um, them. So it's going to be this easy, especially if you have um, leveled up most of your most of your heroes. They're already at rank one weapons, level sixty, and they're at ninety or level ninety or up. And also take note, signature force is very important because signature force deals additional damage. I'm not sure if you don't have signature force that you can um, you can more or less um, uh, what do you call this you can more or less uh, deal that much damage but um, I have, would highly recommend that the heroes that you bring also has signature force so I was playing this in auto and I'm playing this in auto now um, as long as again you have built your your heroes with high damage um toughness healing you'll be fine and also um one thing that, that i'd like to point out if you can see here the hit limit the hit limit actually will go up and um you have you will have to to deal damages uh quicker so that you could you know you could have the three star uh for this episode as well but for me, I didn't. I I I wasn't able to 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 three star this, so I have I'll have to find ways on how to three star this next time. So I need to to level up my heroes more, um, probably up to level hundred. I don't know. Um, I still have to improve on. So far with this team, I'm I'm focusing. more. I have actually um, uh, signature force two point. 2.3 for Wasted Red. That is why I'm bringing in Wasted Red here. Majority. Um, the problem with, with Wasted Red is I cannot bring most of them like Annie because they are of um, red element. So I'm forced to use other heroes here. The only ones that I could bring here for Wasted Red would be Radley and Vergarf. Radley is good because his uh, elemental damage for signature force is also light because of garf so that is why i uh, he's a good fit for this team garf um very good for survivability you can actually opt to bring in tantalo here if you opt to bring him but he has a small damage that is why i didn't bring him here um uh what do you call this you ha i have here Junai also for green as additional um damage for nature to break guardian stones 
so iris again this is an option you can actually change iris if you want to use this theme ramjis is for me is my staple here i don't think i could uh, put in shufraken but you can if you don't have ramji leveled up so iris can be changed to somebody else that has higher damage so take note of that because um if you can see my hit is already up to 33 so a little bit more and uh, and uh, it will exceed the limit which is 45 so this is already wave two so i'm actually going to wave three which is a little bit more a little bit more um what do you call this a little bit more tougher because of the revive of the re of the of the damage reduction of 65 percent so i'm going to manual this to have a quicker battle so that you guys will be able to see the end of this more quickly again i still have i'm not i'm actually still considering the replacement for iris just in case i want to to what they call this i want to 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 three to three star this level so if you have any comments guys on which hero that i will bring in and replace iris please write them down in the comments below so that i could make adjustments to my team so feel free comment uh, also guys don't forget to to subscribe to my channel also like this video if you find this interesting and um, try to support my channel please it really helps me a lot so to continue with um, with this wave three so i'm 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 if you if you can see here i'm ready to over the hit limit so all i have to do now is to finish off baleish but i think he can or he has the ability to bring back his friends the banshees so this might take a quite quite a bit a longer time so he's actually broken now <clears throat> in which i will have to chip away damage i hope that he he can't recover from this i'm already half of his life so we're down to one third hopefully this will be it so i like the color of uh, all black ramsey actually kind of hardcore so for my team for my pvp team i've adapted more or less a black green and white um, color theme the green is mostly olive drab or darker shade of green so i'm nearing the end of this battle he still survived the break so we'll have to see if how long i can uh, hold him see he revived his friends, but it's okay. I have uh, AOE um, to finish them off or to finish him off. So we're near ready. Um, I think this is it for him. No, not yet. One more hit. One more hit. One more hit for Baelish. Bailey, you're dead. Yes. But you have to clear the rest first. So the rest will be, you know, will give you another nuisance in terms of clearing the stage. So again, for chapter 15, it's not really as difficult as the previous chapters. Um, it would, it's actually better for, for everyone because, um, again, I find this more enjoyable clearing it with a relaxed manner. Everybody would be able to clear it as well, as easy um, as possible. Um, I know you guys don't have, uh, haven't had your, some of you guys haven't had your heroes to uh, level up as much. But I think um, the stages here are pretty much very easy. And I think you can, you can try to clear some of the stages as well without, you know, without having any that, any much problem. So there are the Banshee, there is Zeon. And this is their cutscene. So anyway, guys, so that is it for me. Um, hope you enjoyed this video for chapter 15. Take care. This is the Warden, and I'm out.